So this patient is obese, he has a BMI of 30, and um, he has a cardiovascular, clinical cardiovascular disease. Therefore, independent of its HbA1c levels, this patient is, uh, for this patient is recommended the addition of an SGLT2 inhibitor because of the data we have of empagliflozin, at least in Germany and Europe. And I think it's a fair consideration also in this patient with cardiovascular disease for better HB1C control and improvement to add the GLP-1 receptor agonist, which has been proven in the cardiovascular endpoint trial, which is lariaglutide. So he would have a combination therapy of metformin, GLP-1 receptor agonist, added with an SGLT2 inhibitor.